in Butler County. You can see the clouds as they've been moving in this morning, some high clouds, so the sun is definitely still getting through. And that's going to be the case for our morning hours with some sunshine in Dayton. It's 34 degrees. We've got a south wind at 10. Our current wind chill is 26. We're not looking at any stronger wind gusts right now, but heading into the afternoon, the winds may pick up a bit and maybe gust 15 to 20 miles per hour. Not terribly windy, but definitely a breeze. A check of our forecast if you're planning your walk today. You don't have to worry about any rain all day long. This morning we have a little more sunshine. The afternoon probably looking at a little more cloud cover between 2 and 4. 2 o'clock temperature 53 and 4 o'clock 56, so it'll feel better later in the day even compared to yesterday's high temperature. Our pollen count is low on tree, weeds, and grass, so that is nice to see, but the mold count is starting off high this morning, and it's expected to stay high right on through the afternoon hours. Satellite radar loop shows some of those clouds as they've been moving in this morning, but it's dry, there's no precipitation. That's still well off to our south and west. As we go through the day, this moisture will continue to work towards us, and by tonight, that's when we'll start to see some showers moving through the Miami Valley. Our rain chance then stays up for the rest of the week and on into the weekend. So tomorrow's precipitation looks like it would just be something light, maybe some drizzle or light showers, but not an all day thing. We would get some dry time in there. And then Thursday, there's a better chance of some heavier rain that will come through. That will continue to be possible Friday and low pressure tracks across the region Saturday, keeping that rain chance very high. But yes, warm enough that it's all going to be rain. So over the next three days, this takes us through Thursday. There is the potential for one to two inches, and that looks like mainly across the southern half of the Miami Valley with then additional rainfall Friday and Saturday. Uh, so this band of where the heavier rain sets up is something we're gonna kind of track through the week to see where the, exactly that is going to be. It's definitely a forecast you wanna pay attention to if you have travel plans, uh, you don't wanna hit any of that localized flooding. A check of our future track showing we do have some clouds at times today, but also breaks of sunshine. Tonight is when the rain spreads in. And again, this is going to be generally light to moderate rainfall. Wednesday looks like a cloudy day. And again, some occasional very light precipitation will be possible. Then Wednesday night comes some more substantial showers, which will continue to be possible through the day Thursday. We could even hear some rumbles of thunder. Your forecast for today, partly sunny, nice and cool. We'll have a high of 56 degrees. And then tonight, temperatures drop back to a chilly 42 as showers develop. Tomorrow, we'll have some lighter precipitation and then some heavier showers possible Thursday and Friday. It does cool off for the end of the week and start of the weekend with highs in the 50s for a couple of days, but we'll dry out Sunday back up to 60.